day once again and welcome back to Dexter's World Channel. In this life's journey, we're always confronted with lessons. And the lessons that I am going to share with you right now is the fact that in this life, we have to make choices. We cannot just stay neutral and wait for something to happen in our lives. We have to decide for ourselves. And in our decisions, sometimes we get wrong decisions and sometimes we get the right decisions. And as far as I am concerned, it doesn't matter whether you decided right or wrong. What is important is you have made your decision. And that is very important in life. You cannot just stay neutral and expect something good to happen. Why I am saying this is because I was really puzzled in the last few days whether or not to sell some of my ready-to-lay chickens of this Rhode Islands. Actually, I mentioned in my previous videos that we are aiming to have 800 layers of these uh, chickens. Somebody has called me up and offered a good price for 300 ready to lay head. And I was really having a hard time to decide whether I will grab the opportunity or not. After how many days of pondering upon it, I finally decided that I am going to sell 300 of our ready-to-lay eggs chicken in order for us to invest in the development of this particular area. from coming over there are big birds actually during the night there are wild ducks there are kingfishers and this uh, farm birds that can devour all our fish like this one I am 100% sure that they are already protected because we cover this with net and the same thing will happen right here in this bigger pond 
So I am also thinking about making a big net in the middle of this pond. And if you have some suggestions, please comment below what we're gonna do with this pond because I am afraid that there is a big catfish right here or maybe there's a mudfish that will devour all our Japanese koi fingerlings. What we're gonna expect after this is we will be able to fix this one right there and we have expanded the pathway right here and we will complete that up to there and then we will release our Japanese koi and goldfish. followed us because of this chicken farming well there is no worry because we already have selected some 100 bullets to become our future breeders and also we are set to select additional 200 bullets meaning the young hen to become our layers there are two things that we have to consider if we are going to breed them we should choose the best meaning that we will choose those ones that have very beautiful body conformation they have no health issues and we already have chosen at least 100 of them and we will choose another 200 to become our layers and the purpose of these layers is to produce eggs to be sold in the market <laughs> Many of you wanted to know about the conditions of our goats. Well, our goats are pregnant already. Beverly is about to born babies and I hope that she will deliver plenty, plenty of babies. You know, this uh, Tammy is very big. She's really very pregnant. I hope uh, she will become successful during this delivery that is scheduled on the next month. That's, that's gonna be on uh, early December of this year. And you will also note that this area had already been completed up to there and this will have a division right here and then you will see that I also intended a gate right here. From outside we will just go inside through that gate and then we can also go the place of our chickens right there. We already have made several compartments so that this fowls will not be mixing together. So this is really very this is really very important as what I have observed to segregate the geese, the turkeys from the chickens. So come on let's feed our chicken and we will prepare this grass for their noontime snacks. Come on let's go. So this grass is called Mombasa grass and this is best for rabbits, for goats, for cows, for large cattle. And maybe you will ask Dexter, where can we buy the seeds? Well, you can just buy this online and uh, you will pay around 5,000 for 1,000 grams of the seeds. I don't know, but uh, I can just order this online. It's really very available. So guys, we are going to chop this grass once more for the noontime snacks. And it's been our experience that this can also contribute to the health of our breeder and layer chickens. So this is going to be 
the 30% composition of their feeding and uh, we are using commercial pellet for the daily sustenance of these chickens. So we will turn this on like that. our effort to finish the hanging of these nets but time doesn't really permit because we run short of time because it's really very difficult to join these nets and spread this all over to this mud pen. In our next video we're gonna load some 3,000 heads of Japanese koi. It is the breed of Kohako and this Oturi koi that we have in the house and we are looking forward to also release another batch of koi right here in this bigger tank. And also, I would like to make mention about the rabbitry. Well, how many days ago, we are really disturbed by the strong winds and typhoon here in this place. And our maternity cages were flooded. That is why we were forced to gather all the kits and place them in the boxes so that they will not be soaked with water. This is actually the downside if you are allowing your rabbits to just deliver babies underneath the ground. So this is actually the farming. You know, sometimes we encounter difficulties, sometimes we encounter some problems, but uh, I am so glad that we can address and give solution to the problem. So that's my principle in life, do not deal with your problems. If you have some circumstances, then think of ways on how to get out of the problem. And there are many solutions if you are just open-minded and if you have a positive mindset. So we're gonna succeed in this farming and that's my desire to influence and to also encourage other people, especially our subscribers and followers, to do farming activities so that we can have 
another source of income to augment our income for the family. So far, this is all that we can share. I hope you will continue to like and share our videos. And if you are new to this channel, please subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you will be notified of every video that we are going to upload. We are uploading videos every five days, only here at Dexter's World!